So, a judge today took the right away from her mother because she wasn't vaccinated. Then he reversed it because <laughs> everybody started getting on that judge and telling him, you can't do that. She's not unfit just because she's not vaccinated. Um, the reason why she didn't get vaccinated is because she have bad reactions to vaccines that her doctor knows that as well well let me give you the broadcast on this revolt because she's not vaccinated against covid can see her son again but she's worried it might not last long wgn's megan dwyer live in the loop with that story megan Micah and Ray, this turn of events happened at a child support hearing. Mom and dad share custody, but it was actually the judge who brought this issue up out of the blue. We really need to make sure all of our children are safe. That's the question now in family court. The judge did what I thought was right. Is a parent who refuses to get vaccinated endangering their children. Normally, when we talk about endangering a child, we're talking about a parent with a substance abuse issue or who's physical against the child. The issue came to light recently in a Cook County courtroom in a child support hearing. A judge asked the mother whether she was vaccinated when she said no because of bad reactions to vaccines in the past. At this point, she's taken the advice of an MD and not a JD. The judge ordered she could not see her 11-year-old son. She hasn't seen the child since August 8th. The same judge reversed course this morning, vacating the portion of his order about the vaccine, but he did not close the door on it being an issue down the road. Of course, she's very happy to be able to see her son again, but she's also very anxious, anticipating what the father's attorney may file. The dad's lawyer is now planning to file an emergency motion tomorrow morning to suspend her parenting time. They only want her to be able to see her son by Zoom, if at all. So there's no personal contact because we want to make sure the child is safe. And if she thinks she needs not to take the vaccine for whatever reason, then we think that the child should not be physically with her until she takes the vaccine. Even before the pandemic, divorced parents argued over vaccinations, but normally it's whether to vaccinate the child, not the parent. This is a big issue because of what I'm doing here. We'll save one life, one child's life, it's worth it. So I can see a lot of parents getting back at other parents um, by using this. This is wrong. This is totally wrong because vaccinated people are catching COVID too and giving it to their kids.